Well, everybody, guess what I did? I went down and got some white paneling. Let me show you what it is. It's this stuff that you put in showers. You know, it's got that texture to it. That stuff. And I don't know. I don't know how thick it is. I don't know how many. I think it's measured in millimeters. But I got a sheet of that. And uh, I already cut it down. So now what I got to do is I got to pull up my drill and uh, drill some holes in it and then put some zip ties because that's going to be the only thing that holds this stuff on. And I was cutting this stuff up with my saw and now I've got like this white crap all over me. I've got crotch dandruff. Crotch dandruff. And I've got this little piece left over. Now these gaps are exactly 12 inches and I cut these at 11 inches because Hopefully you guys will be able to see this. Uh, maybe not. Nope. Because what I'll be doing is I'll be lifting this up and covering up down there, leaving a kind of a gap down there so I'll be able to run my ties in through there and hook them underneath the angle iron right there. See how that is? Yeah. Okay, so let's get to it. See what I've done is I've drilled holes through through the paneling along the uprights, angle iron, and then I drew drill holes overlapping about maybe half of an inch, so it brings it all up. Look at the whole panel. About all this here, but uh, yeah, that's stiff enough. It ain't gonna be flop. Well, it might flop around a little bit, but oh, shoot. Yeah, I'm gonna have to drill a hole and put a twist tie up in there so it ain't making that noise vibrating down the road. Yeah, I'll have to put a twist tie probably right, right, right there. That's how she's gonna look when I'm done. So let me keep working on it, but it's getting too dark for me to be cameraing, so yeah. I got the paneling on one side done and I'm putting stickers on the other side. And some of the stickers are working okay, some of them aren't because uh, pretty much this one Red ZZ02, I can't put this sticker on because it's white. I didn't realize that until I started getting ready to peel it off and put it on. The sticker's white, so that that won't be seen. But I'll throw up some pictures here, like this one, this one. You can see that there's a lot of prime real estate right there, guys. So get your butts in gear and contact Steiny and get some stickers made. I have a few others that I'm going to put on the other side, but I'm going to wait until tomorrow to do those ones. I'm going to come out here tomorrow and do the other side and put some stickers on too. I still have to get the steel uh, and the paneling for the big stickers, you know, that's going to go on the back of the trailer. I'm going to have to contact Shane because I want a few uh, smaller ones made too because I have to, I want to put some stuff. Hopefully you guys will be able to see this. I want to put some right here on the neck of the trailer on these two bars. I want to put white uh, T-Man's go-karts on YouTube right along the side here. Yeah. So I'll be contacting you there, Steiny, and we'll see if we can get some stickers made up for that. Yep, I'm sticking to my guns here, guys. So hopefully the uh, next video that I'll be putting up, I'm going to start getting back into the full screen machine. I'm going to start working on the back support for the engine. And yeah, I'll be putting that video up hopefully Thursday, weather permitting. It's getting really damn cold out here. And I'll talk at you guys later. And remember, jump over there to Sulphur City Homestead Design. Get some stickers made because i got a lot of room on this thing. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See you Thursday or maybe Friday. Bye-bye.
but every 